And tonight's school patrol, a show-stopping local high school chorus is drawing a lot of attention. It used to be when you mentioned Pearl Cone High, it was usually for something negative. But there's been a steady turnaround at the now entertainment magnet school. And the class project is resulting in accolades for students, teachers, and a national anthem. I want you to listen to this song. I want you to learn every part. There is magic going on at Pearl Cone Entertainment Magnet High School. It's amazing. Let freedom be. There's a special project. Find which voices connect with each other. Connecting students. And I kind of did it as a jigsaw possible because it was so uh, tedious. I listened to everyone and I cut them up or I split them each phrase. Teachers. You play a more uh, quarter, but what I really need to do for you to play is more lyrical in nature. Scholars. There's no walls, no barrier resistant that can stop the great tide of the everlasting hope. The project. I gave the kids a CD of Lift Every Voice and Sing. Instead of making it just the Lift Every Voice and Sing, we made it our Lift Every Voice and Sing. We have a record label here at the Pearl Cone, which is the official record label for Metro. And my job is to teach them the entire record industry. Cedric Caldwell and his brother Victor are Grammy Award winning producers and musicians. This project uh, covers everything. They decided to sing and record Lift Every Voice and Sing to honor the African American National Anthem. First of all, you have so many different artists with so many different voices, so many styles. We even get to cover history because we're talking about black history and black history in the world. The project took advantage of vocalists, student videographers, and writers as well. The beauty in We Are The World was that you had a diversity, different voices. The model they used, the 1985 iconic We Are The World. And we studied how each soloist would start out doing a phrase and another soloist would come in and harmonize with that phrase and then shove the other one to the side and he would take over. What was hard about pulling together was you have 13 lead singers. I think I might have sung the song a good five times. And we picked those best uh, lines that they did. And they didn't cut nobody out. The first time I heard that, tears my eyes because so much talent that we had. We started together, we finished together like a family. That's what we did. <laughs> In the end, it was a success on all levels. Now that they see that we have different things to bring to the table, and this song shows that. And you can see the making of Lift Every Voice and Sing by going to newschannel5.com, where we've put a link to their YouTube version. Rory? Thanks, Vicki. You know,